The London Studios, home to The Graham Norton Show, The X Factor, Alan Carr and, for one night only, to ITV Fixers as well. Over 150 fixers, 200 performers, 43 ITV Fixers staff, six celebrities and 530 audience members are all involved in tonight's performance. Young people, our fixers, are working alongside television professionals at the top of their game. So why are industry leaders prepared to give up their time for free for fixers? ITV Fixers is a fantastic organisation that is uh, helping young people communicate in the media. It's anything that gives people a chance to make their own films, communicate with people about issues that are important to them sounds a brilliant idea to me. And it's really important that television isn't just seen as a, as a place for wannabes. Often um, programmes, I think, are very vacuous and some of the very serious things that ITV Fixers talk about just generally don't get seen. Working in TV, you're in a sort of pressurised environment where there are lots of executives worrying about very trivial things. And I think what's been nice about this show is you really feel it's just a lot of young people being creative. Now, we've all seen what the front of a TV studio looks like, but what goes on backstage? Is it the colour of your skin or the country that you're in? We're all brothers, we're all kids. What is race? What? Because I'm not I can't wait to get on that stage and do my thing, you know. It's an opportunity I've been waiting for for a very, very, very long time. Preparation started here early this morning, and as the audience arrive, nerves are starting to creep up on some of our performers. Very nervous. Um, I've seen the big set and the lights and everything look amazing. Um, but I thought I might be interviewed in the audience. I didn't realise I was actually going on stage, so I'm quite nervous. OK, we're about to start and the atmosphere back here is electric. Now, these fixes with me here are about to see how their performances can be turned into TV magic. <laughs> Completely mad experience for us all. Like we've never been, we've never been this far before with anything that we've ever done. To go through fixes and come to here is just like it's amazing. Like, what do you think you're doing? Yeah. That applause is for you. Is that good? Yeah, that's, that's good. Really that's a really good thing. Yeah? Good, good audience. Crazy. Yeah, nuts. I wonder again. I know you said to me earlier that you were a bit nervous. It was great. Um, I first I was a bit nervous, but you know I got over it. That was amazing. 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 So much fun. <laughs> Oh my god, I feel crazy. <laughs> now I'm feeling great. It's like normally I'm not nervous, but this time it's like. And it feels like there's a thousand moths and butterflies just crawling and going up and down my body. Well. There may be a lot of talent on show tonight, but these fixers aren't just here to show off. Their songs, dramas, and projects are often based closely on their own lives and experiences. The website is to help other people who suffer from child abuse. Um, by reading my story, for example, they can sort of relate and find the common themes and feel less alienated. My young person's coordinator, Wayne, uh, put me in for the Women of Courage Award, which I won a couple of months later out of hundreds of other entries, so that felt quite good. I'm all buzzing now. <laughs> it was really scary, but when you get into it, it's, it's like, wow. How are you feeling? Are you nervous? Quite nervous, yes, but I'll be okay. I think I'll do well. Cool. How are you feeling? You're, you are bringing up the end of the show. Yeah, I know. It's, it's good, good times, you know. I'm really excited. I'm, um, I, I feel kind of honoured that I can end it out, you know. <laughs> inspired by the young people that they've met tonight and I think that young people generally feel that they don't have a very positive image in the media well that should what we've just done tonight should change all that people do what they do and say what they say and act how they act because we can't change it what ITV gets from this relationship is the chance to show young people as they really are engaged and enthusiastic and passionate about things that matter to them it's down to his fear fear of ourselves and insecurities we hold so dear but it's such a powerful group of young people, um, full of passion, full of energy, full of commitment, and when they get together, just look what they can do. Tonight's event was just gobsmackingly good, um, and a shining example, really, of, of the quality of the, of the work that young people are capable of when they're involved with things that really matter to them. Right, well, we've given you a taste of what it's been like backstage here at The Big Fix tonight. If you want to see what our audience saw, go to our website, www.itvfixers.com, and check out the footage.